With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question given here is, in a Langmuir model of adsorption of a gas on a solid surface, options are the rate of dissociation of adsorbed molecules from the surface does not depend on the surface covered. The adsorption at a single site on the surface may involve multiple molecules at the same time. The mass of the gas striking a given area of a surface is proportional to the pressure of the gas. The mass of gas striking a given area of surface is independent on of the pressure of the gas. So, according to the Langmuir adsorption isotherm, first of all, we'll like like write the adsorptions done on this Langmuir. adsorption isotherm so the first adsorption was that the adsorption is a monolayer and not multilayer monolayer not multilayer that is the only one layer is adsorbed on the adsorbent like if there is an adsorbent here so only first layer will be adsorbed and like it is a mono layer process and not a multi layer right so there will be therefore there will be number of sites available for adsorption if that is equals to n so theta is equal to number of sites occupied upon total number of the sites available that is n so from here we can calculate the number of sites occupied so that is equal to theta into n right so the occupied sites is equal to theta into n second assumption we can say is about the rate of adsorption that is roa or rate of dissociation so that is basically directly proportional to the pressure of the gas present that is uh, like striking on the surface and third is also that the rate of adsorption is directly proportional to the available sites available sites that is equal to total number of sites total number of sites minus occupied occupied sites so that is total number of sites is n and the occupied site is n my uh, n theta so this is the relation also according to the isotherm the langmuir adsorption isotherm so the mass of the mass of gas striking a given area of the surface is proportional to the pressure of the gas so this is given by the isotherm that is x by m is equals to a p upon 1 plus b p where m is uh, like x is the mass of the uh, at gas adsorbed and m is the on like m mass of the adsorbent right and p is the pressure here and a and b are the constants so this relation gives that the uh, rate of uh, adsorption is directly proportional to the pressure so from the options given we will like uh, find the answer now so first is the rate of dissociation of adsorption molecules from the surface does not depend on the surface covered but we have like written here that it depends on the available sites so this is the false statement second is the adsorption at a single site of the surface may involve multiple molecules at the same time no it is only a mono layer and there are no multiple molecules so this again this is the wrong statement the mass of the gas striking a given area of the surface is proportional to the pressure of the gas this is correct 
and the last is the mass of striking is independent so this is not independent this is dependent and proportional so the only third statement is correct so this is the required answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today